How to install Xiaomi EU ROM on the POCO X3 Pro Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can install Xiaomi EU ROM on your POCO X3 Pro. Now I do have the global variant of the POCO X3 Pro but the process will work on the Indian variant of the POCO X3 Pro as well. So what are the things which you need? Well, for starters, you do need to have an unlocked bootloader and then you also need to have a custom recovery installed. Now, how do you unlock the bootloader? How do you install a custom recovery? Videos for those can be found in the description of the video. Next thing, make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60%. Do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30%. Also, make sure you have a backup of all your pictures, videos, anything important which you have on your device because we are going to perform a format data and you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Next thing I would recommend you have is a USB OTG drive or a micro SD card and that is because the current recoveries which are available for the POCO X3 Pro at the time of recording this video they do not support encryption on stock MIUI so if you go into your custom recovery you will not be able to access the internal storage if you are booting into the recovery from your power button and the volume up button combination next thing you need to do is you will go into settings and then you will go into password and security remove your screen lock fingerprint and face unlock once that is done go back scroll down go into me account and remove your me account once that is done go back go into accounts and sync and remove your google account once you have removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once now why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we're doing this because we're going from one rom to another and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device next question which i might get a lot is what if i am on a custom rom based on aosp if you are on a custom rom which is based on aosp the steps will remain the same you just have to skip the steps which are not applicable to you which does include removing your me account because you don't have the option of installing or associating your me account on an aosp rom anyways so you can go into settings on your aosp rom and then if you go into security you can remove your fingerprint and stuff and go into accounts to remove all the accounts which are associated with your device next thing we need to do is we need to check what are the files which we need so here it is this is my usb otg drive and let me go ahead and attach it to the phone and then we can open the file manager application and i should have something called my usb otg drive on the top so here it is usb storage connected now let me go into the x3 pro factory folder even though it is named x3 pro factory it has the eu rom so you need the rom itself this is the xiaomi eu rom for the poco x3 pro and then because if you are using the indian variant then twrp does not let you flash roms because of different code names which is an issue which needs to be fixed so we are going to use orange fox and these are the only two files which you need so next thing we need to do is we are going to boot into our current recovery and right now i do have twrp so first of all turn off your device and then once the device has turned off press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the recovery logo so here it is we are booting into team win or twrp recovery do note that the usb otg drive is still attached and yes you can of course use your micro sd card as well so first of all if i go into install you will see i am in the internal storage because you do have sd card over here but i'm not able to see anything so that is the issue wherein encryption is not being supported by twrp or for that matter orange fox either so we will tap on select storage and because i am using a usb otg i will select usb USB OTG if you are using micro SD select micro SD and then select OK so here are the contents of my USB OTG drive right so first of all let us go into x3 pro factory and for starters we do need to change our recovery so we will select install image now 
before i forget you went into x3 pro factory because that is where i have all my files in case you have them elsewhere select that folder so we will select install image now ignore the underscore file because that is from mac os for time machine purposes but we are going to select this orange fox unofficial on the next screen select recovery and then swipe to confirm flash if you get errors about unable to mount ignore those as well now image flash completed without any issues tap on the home button reboot and select recovery if you get the message about no os install no worries swipe to reboot and there it is you can see we are booting into orange fox recovery so this is the main page of orange fox and as you can see sd card is selected by default so tap on the down arrow beside it and you will get the other options internal storage micro sd or usb otg again i am flashing from usb otg i will select that if you are using micro sd use micro sd scroll down and navigate to the folder where you have the xiaomi eu ROMs. So in my case it is in the x3 pro hyphen factory folder and here and just select the Xiaomi EU file and that's about it swipe to install. Now as you can see we are getting some errors but those can be ignored because the main ROM was flashed without any issues here it is script succeeded result was 1. Rest of the errors which we are getting are because our device is encrypted and the recovery is not able to access the data partition anyways we will go back and then select the third option which is your wipe option here in top right format data type in yes again format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device so make sure you have a backup of all those things and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right now once format data is done we can go back and then select the fourth option which is your menu herein we will select reboot and select recovery and as you can see we have booted back into orange fox recovery one more time so now we will go into the third option once again which is your wipe and you need to select dalvik cache and the data partition dalvik data and cache and then swipe to wipe everything is done next up just reboot system and once we see the boot animation we can disconnect our usb otg drive as well because we don't need it anymore so here it is we do have the boot animation miui let me disconnect the usb otg drive and of course the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick setup is complete swipe up to enter the system let us see how that goes and there it is we do have the pretty cool looking super live wallpaper let us go into settings and my device bam here it is xiaomi eu miui 12.5.1 stable device is poco x3 pro and there it is peeps we have also gotten rid of the crappy animations of poop launcher anyways so there it is peeps that is how you install xiaomi eu rom on your poco x3 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you